N4 HNH here with the ASU FTDX 5000 listening to uh, Morning Rag Chew here on 3.856. Really nice fellas. But there's another QSO going on at uh, 2 kilohertz down. And I guess you can hear that squawk. So over to the DSP here. I've already got IPO on, limiting the front end a little bit. So we're going over here to the DSP. First of all, let's take some of the hash out with the digital noise filter. Set it five on a scale of one to 15. DSP. Now you can go down to 1.5 width with it in the normal position up to four. Default is 2.4. I'm going to turn it off and I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click, uh, press the uh, narrow button right here. Right below the two blue ones. All right, now I'll go back over here to the DSP. I'm in narrow mode now. So you can go between 1.8 down to 200. Shift. And the pre selector. Called micro tune or mu tune. Let's see what it would sound like without all that. Uh, I hope so. uh, Turned off the pre-selector. Disable shift. Disable DSP. Turn off narrow. And turn off digital noise reduction. Well, no, I'm selling it. Um, I'm selling it too. There's a fellow here runs Versa. a runs an antique uh, uh, furniture restoration. He called the furniture doctor. And uh, there we go. Got a bunch of these old Tremendous what you can do with the uh, DSP and features and so, um, uh, I really to stay, uh, here in, in combination with the uh, such things as the. Micro tune pre selector and also engaging IPO so you don't you don't really need on, on the 75 uh, meter band or even the 40 meter band. You really don't need an RF amplifier there in the front end of the receiver. Sometimes you may even want to kick in uh, attenuation. And also, don't forget, RF gain, one of the greatest inventions ever. No. Other than the fact that we had to knock the base out uh, when we tightened it, we've got a pretty good, uh, pretty good sound. There we go. I'm using the shift now to restore some of the low end. Again, let me disable um, all this. And it's carved too. It's carved oak um, frame. Pre selector. Shift. Digital noise reduction. Uh, it, it's mostly glass. Yeah. And then turn it off narrow. And I'll re enable again. Narrow. Digital noise reduction, DSP width, shift, pre-selector. Yeah, they, uh, they're collectors, Adam. Uh, a lot of people buy them and a lot of 
people pay a lot of money for me. So there you have it. It's a world class receiver there. I tried every radio on the market, including the FT 101, which, by the way, is is a beast. Uh, and it's definitely on par with this. And the pre selector that's built into it is um, rated even higher, even better. But uh, I like the ergonomics, the knobs, the meter, and uh, this external speaker, the SM5000 station monitor there, um, was a surprise. Uh, I like it more than I thought I would. Audio tapering capabilities it has. Uh, the the uh, phase reversal just about puts some like surround sound in the room with you. Okay, hope you found this video informative. 73 from N4HNH.